I issued my Navy SEAL challenge. I don't think there's one Navy SEAL who could survive a week training with me. A lot of you Navy SEALs didn't show up. This man Mitch, he showed up. It was a war, come on, get it to me, my dog. And he lasted 25 minutes. So this is my boy Mitch. How many fights have you had? 17, 18, something like that. Yeah, a lot of fights. Let me just stop this for a second and say this dude is no amateur. Obviously, he's a pro. Also, want to say he's pretty jacked, man. I mean, you guys had a lot of fights, so I don't know if it's fair to say you're. I mean, you're a Navy SEAL, but is it fair to say? I mean, you're also a professional fighter. Yeah. And there's not many Navy SEALs who are professional fighters, so we'll do. We're gonna what? Do five fives? These Navy yeah. SEALs, these yeah. influencers, they all hit me up. It's like I kill people. You ain't gonna kill me. The reason why we filmed it, like. He's like, Sean, like, are you going to film it? I'm like, no. And she's like, Sean, why do I think he's bringing a camera crew? So I'm like, no, I think it's going to be cool. And the mother gets out with the camera crew. So I'm like, oh, okay. That's the thing. Everyone's a content creator these days. You guys remember the one Navy SEAL who called out Sean Strickland and threatened to put his finger up his butt? If I needed to, I would run my thumb up your butt. Everyone's trying to get clout somehow, even the SEALs. SEALs are no different than chefs. They're just people who do something and uh, attention is is the game right so, so like people like funny people, like they they think navy seals are like the boogeyman like no no you ain't the boogeyman that's like the mentality that fighters should have yeah. always be ready it doesn't yeah. matter i'm not afraid to fight yeah you know there's a lot of people that can pick and you know right. fights and only want to take a fight if they're absolutely yeah. certain they're gonna win or whatever and no guts no glory right yeah. <laughs> bro i was at home depot and this old man with a with a vietnam hat came up to me my son comes up to me he's like hey did you sean strickland i'm like yeah i'm sean strickland and the dad goes wait i i think i know you i'm like oh f he goes you talk about the navy seal i'm like oh f like what do i say to this guy wearing a vietnam hat like i can't even talk like, because I like what you said about those Navy SEALs. They're a bunch of women. Oh, <laughs> no. Yeah. That's crazy. Now, I know you're in the Navy, bro, so let's not make this weird. That's what's exhausting. So you see how he's just walking you down? If you've never sparred at a high level, then you don't know how that feels. It's exhausting. Reacting to things that aren't really there, that's what gasses you out. Someone get a bell. Someone get a bell. Those Someone leg kicks suck. Oh no. I don't want to knock you out. I want to make you quit. I don't want to quit from the leg. The first round, look at him. He's exhausted. Didn't get hit with anything hard per se, right? Not up here at least. I could tell just by his movements that he's a legit pro. If you don't dedicate your entire life to this thing, man, you can't part-time it. And you'll feel it once you get in front of a guy who lives and breathes it, like a guy like Sean. He just Nick Diazing him right now. Oh no. Head forward, hips back, but listen, bro. No shame, man. Oh. Right to the liver. Body. That's what killed him, man. That's what killed him. It, I think it was a push kick to the fing liver. That did it. And the thing is, you're never really going to recover from that. People don't get it. They think they have to be hit hard to get gassed. That's all it takes, man. Just touch, just touch them, touch them, right there, touch them, touch them. All of this, diaphragms being compressed. This is exhausting here. And it's the leg kicks, right? They're not necessarily like gonna stop them per se, but you know what it does? It reminds you of the fact that you're in there with someone better. And that has a psychological effect as well. Nice knee to the sternum. Right in the, oh, I was a calf, almost got him. Touch them, touch them, watch this. Oh, beautiful, almost like a Sasai movement. Puts him right on his hip. Oh. Oh. Now Sean's starting to pick. Oh, that was a little much. The kid showed up and he, he wanted this. Let's not pretend as if he didn't want it. Oh, no. Don't quit. My legs are already. Are we quitting? <laughs> he said, My legs are already up, are laying on the floor.
I mean, Sean's doing this, again, to a professional MMA fighter in ABC. Keep that in mind as you watch this. A guy with 17 pro fights. Right in the kidneys, dude. So for all those guys out there that were like, Oh, f*** Sean Strickland up. Trust and believe you won't. <laughs> Wild behavior, disrespectful, video game-like behavior. Come on now, with the short uppercuts to the forehead. Hey, Navy SEALs, I stand corrected. 25 minutes. I was wrong. You have my respect. You did not quit. Well, I had no delusions of winning this fight. <laughs> but uh, it's pretty clear after, I don't know, 45 seconds that the mission was to survive <laughs> and uh, I had nothing for him. Sean's the man. <laughs> that sucked. Bro, you ate that head kick like breakfast, my man. Drummers aren't going to play the guitar better than a guitar player. Everyone just settle down and stay in your lane. The Navy SEAL was on Jesse on Fire's channel. I kind of scrubbed through it and I got to see there's a big injury here. Not a big injury, but a significant enough amount of uh, injuries. How many leg kicks do you think you got hit with? He caught you with a couple of those, like, you know, where you like just, you know, where it gets you right behind the hamstring and it lifts your leg up. Oh, and yeah. I was like, oh, I sh man. Look I at got, this thing. I got, uh, you see it? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a pretty That's bad bruising. That's some bad bruising, dude. That's falling off a bike type situation. So much here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But right here. That fucking That's the IT band, too. That hurts. That, that attacks the lower back. That just caught my eye. Fucking crazy, man.